This is a training video for the WasteCorp Super Duty vacuum system, 100 gallon to 250 gallon system. This particular unit is our 115 gallon unit with the optional Hany hose reel. This is a skid mounted unit. It can also be equipped with a trailer mounted version as well. Some of the features that are on this system is a standard Honda gas engine. It can also be equipped with a diesel engine. It has electric start. In the event that the battery were to fail, you do have a backup pull coil reel. It has the vacuum pump, that it's a vein pump. You've got your vacuum relief valve. You have your discharge relief valve. In here is your primary protection with the balls that close when the tank is full. And in the back, you have your secondaries. In the event those balls failed, you have secondaries that will protect the pump. Operation of this unit is very simple. To pull a vacuum, you'd start the engine, you'd pull this handle out to pull vacuum, and make sure that your suction nozzle is closed. You're going to wait for the gauge to pull around 15 mercury. At that time, you can open the valve and start sucking your product. After you're finished loading the tank with your product, make sure that the valve is closed. And at that point, while the engine's running, you can put the handle halfway. This will not pull a vacuum or offload. It's in the neutral state. When you want to offload the product, push the handle in and wait for the vacuum gauge to read 5 PSI positive. Once it reaches that, you can open this ball valve to offload the product to any destination. Once the product is finished offloading, close the valve and you can shut off the engine. As far as any regular maintenance is concerned, make sure that you have proper oil level in the oil reservoir. This will ensure that the vacuum pump is being properly lubricated. This particular pump uses a synthetic 10W30 oil. Some of our other pumps use a different type of hydraulic oil, but this particular unit uses the 10W30 synthetics. Also ensure on a daily basis that your muffler is drained daily, and that's done by opening this up and letting any of the oil drain out. That should be done on a daily basis. On a monthly basis, you should also clean the veins of the pump. You can run diesel fuel through the, through the veins to ensure that those veins stay clean. That should be done on a monthly basis. And just make sure that overall that all the components are nice and tight. Another maintenance tip is to remove the access hatch to clean any interior on a monthly basis. That's simply done by unscrewing these hand knobs. Sliding this back, which allows you to remove it and access any interior and do any, any inspection. On a daily basis, you should also ensure that there's no liquid in the secondaries. If there are, you can open up this valve to drain it, or you can also unscrew it and clean this out with water. If there's excessive condensation in the sight glass or buildup of sludge, you can unscrew the sight glass and clean it out. Also ensure that your exhaust hose is not plugged so the pump can properly function.